All right, people, welcome back. More Vine than Why. Today is Tuesday. It means we are using Clay Glitcher C Bell. So this deck will be, of course, getting some changes in the upcoming future. Uh, I would definitely, I, I would love to play that second Dark Hole, but I feel like if I put that second Dark Hole and I run two, I will never see it because that's probably how it's gonna go down. You know, because you put in two Dark Holes, you know, if, that's the worst number. You, if you put a cut, well, except for a zero, because of course you'll never see it. But at one number generator, you'll probably get it. Three, you know, it's increased odds, you know, the increased odds of you getting that card. But two, like, I don't know, I don't know. I don't know, so, that might suck. Like this hand. I don't know, my opponent has a 60 card deck and no extra deck, so I have no idea what the hell they're doing, but. Oh, my bad, that's not a 60 card deck, that's actually a 59 card deck. But he's running card trader for consistency. Card trader for consistency. Cute. Oh, he's not going to attack, huh? Oh, well, thank you. I got foolish. So I got the debris dragon and the foolish. Like I said, this number generator is interesting. Interesting. So you're running this rose warrior. She's a tuner. And she can be a synchro, except you have no synchro monsters. Because you have no extra deck. Interesting. Interesting. Oh. Then, of course... You know we're going to be running that card. It's already about to get stupid, so you don't even need to ask, because you already know it's going to be stupid. And you're probably wondering, like, what card do you mean, Daniel? Of course I You know what I mean. That fucking stupid card. You know, so far, I haven't had to get you, Bell, involved with this duel at all. I don't have anything with you, Bell, right now. I didn't get anybody to send you, Bell. I'm, I'm just going with the whole Mally Plague play. I'm going to summon... I'll go ahead and sink eight. So I'm thinking about just MSTing that. Uh, yeah, I you know what. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go ahead and MST this one, and I'm gonna scrap the other one. Not really worried about the card trader right now because with no extra deck, I doubt he can get anything strong enough to stop me. Plus, he's running shit like that, so. Uh, do I want to draw into another Mass Chameleon? No, not really, so I'll just go Plague Effect. Put you on top of the deck. So I'm Plague. Mally Effect. Go ahead and just banish him. I'm glad I, I drew that Foolish. Well, I could have drew almost anything. Anything to send. And I've been okay, because opening up with Plague is nice. Sink it again. Go ahead and go for that nice, beautiful scrap dragon that we all love. Go scrap, effect, target, deals, and your uh, face down back row. Oh, okay. <laughs> he was just like, no, I can't get, I can't beat that, I can't beat that. Like, uh huh. If he had an extra deck, you know, he maybe could have axiton me or something. I had deals, but still. B list soldier? That's not BLS. BLS does not stand for B list soldier. I don't even know what the hell B list soldier is. Rock for life. Okay. Your ultimate nightmare. Oh, and we got a uh, nefarious archfiend and nefariousness. So, not bad. I can just go ahead and uh, just send you Bell and have nefarious archfiend and nefariousness. Go ahead and pop it for me with the call of haunted and summon terror or summon also nightmare. So, not terrible. Alright, this. Okay. I'm gonna search for Armageddon Knight. I know I have Ultimate Nightmare in my hand, but the problem is, if he has a bottom list, my plans are gonna get totally shut down, so it might be wiser to go ahead and, uh. And just, oh, I was gonna get Armageddon Knight anyway. I'm gonna summon. Fact. Break to scale. Industry chain, Feck failure. Oh, and I was gonna draw you Bell. All right. <laughs> All right, you're cute. You're cute. You're cute, Deanne. You're like, is this the card you wanted? Is this the card you're trying to be a fucking magician, Deanne? Like, no. Stop. Stop it. Stop it. No. Bad, Deanne. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right. On attack decoration. Long string. All right. This is gonna be uh. Uh, interesting one. Mm 
So who are you summoning? Say, this is Thursday's deck. Alright, so he probably has the, um, GL2 in his hand, so then he's gonna go ahead and summon. He's gonna summon triple of them, then I should only side two, because he's probably gonna spin back three of my cards. Go ahead. If I had them reverse, I would love to show you it. Oh, okay. Didn't see that coming. Sink six? Sink ten. Interesting. One Nordic Beast tuner and two or more non tuner monsters. Yep. 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 Once per turn, you can negate the effects of all pieces of monster from control into an phase. You can phase this card. Draw is destroyed by your opponent's card. The balance eyes. So it's in this card and click it here. Okay. Ouch. Uh, is that tw 26? I got a huge chunk out of my life point, shit. Well, he didn't do what I thought he was going to do, so I guess that's okay. So, it's going to be really hard to handle this guy. Except it isn't, because I can handle him right now, actually. Not through a play that I want to do, but a play that I might have to do out of necessity. <coughs> Alright. Special summon. Normal summon. Overlay. Do I have one one? I'd rather go into one one. Act. Attach to. Give me that. There you go. Now you're not destroyed by card effects, so you know you won't be coming back every single damn turn knowing the fuck out of me. And now I got the. Um, now I got the play. I got the nefarious action nefariousness play. Not plan on activating anytime soon as long as he doesn't do anything. Oh, broke charge. Oh, broke charge. <coughs> this one I thought I had the situation handled. He was like, uh, broke charge? Like, oh, okay. Just gonna go for another one. Like, damn, I just handled this situation. I just fucking handled this situation. Just fucking handled it. Yep. Ah, stupid Brook Charge. Ah. Uh, during your end phase, I'm gonna go ahead and activate this. Bring back your bell. Arch themed effect. Fact. Like, god damn. Oh, thank you. Once again, I did not know what DN being a magician is just like, oh, we're gonna put Terra on top of his deck. Uh, like, no, 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 no. No. How about no? Uh, is there anything else I want to do? I want to handle this situation right here, right now. Because this guy just is gonna keep coming back and flicking 800 to my ass. So, no, thank you. Fact. Wait, who do I already have? I need to check my graveyard again. No one. I have absolutely no one. Then I guess I'll just go ahead and drop Mally. Alright, now I can draw. Oh, I was gonna draw an arm again tonight anyway. Probably should have waited for that. Our thing is awesome. Fact. Oh my god. Get out of here. <laughs> Please. Is that game? It's totally game. Unless he has some kind of call to haunt it or something, which I think he might have. Because God. Fucking broke charge. Like get out of my get out of here. Sure. Ugh. 
go ahead. Okay, what could you t possibly top deck into? Oh, huh, nice top deck. I'm trying to handle the situation right now. I want to. I want to handle the situation. All right, you're not gonna beat me through luck. I'm gonna outskill you, definitely. Go ahead and set one of your Yangzing monsters. It's okay. It's a little slow. Alright. And then you'll go, oh, my Yangzing effect, my creation effect, effect, effect. Like, mm hmm. Yep. <sighs> so that's already two D prisons. Of course, there's one more. And there goes both my 101 and my Castell, so. Well, of course, I would love to try to handle these. These monsters have to be destroyed, right? Might go Dark and Send. Go ahead. This might be a risky one. Try to end this door right now with Ultimate Nightmare. You know what? I can make a Scrap Dragon. Just to make sure I end this door. Yeah. Finale effect. Yep, yep, yep. End this door right now. Unless he has something taught me like a Trental or something, which he might, which would kind of piss me off, but I would be okay. Normal summon. Sink. Eight. I normal summon this turn. Scrap. Scrap effect. So it's probably a D person, but if it's anything to stop me, I'm just going to get rid of it now. Okay. I'll say this is over. Okay, I don't. Okay. Then you lose. So, no chain. Okay. GG? <laughs> yes! <laughs> oh, you're gonna synchro summon. What is that? Alright, what does it say? When can you synchro summon? I forgot that Yang Zings could do that. Okay, during the battle phase. Alright, that's fine. Alright, and then I destroy this. Alright, that's fine. Yep. He's trying to survive, but I don't, I don't know, man. I don't know. I really wanted that fucking Sawani for game, but fuck, he had to go. Nope, I completely forgot that Yang Zings do that because fucking Yang Zings.
uh, synchro summon start of battle phase or attack declaration. Can you do it? Is it at the start of the battle phase? Open turn during your opponent's main phase or battle phase. Okay. Wonder what this is. Two, three, four, five. Okay. I'm guessing that it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, because I think this is Jiatsu. He's going to go into a Black Rose, blow up the field. Then I can just chain them for some Terra. And then during his end phase, I can bring back uh, Nefarious Archery and Nefariousness by destroying Terra, summoning Ultimate Nightmare, summoning Armageddon Knight in this game. So that's what I'm assuming that this is, is Jiatsu. But even if it isn't Jiatsu and it's actually. Um, uh, no, I can't. Because I can't. I already, uh, declare, declared, uh, declared my attack on the last Suwani Sua in which you sync summoned the field was changed but I didn't re -de uh, declare oh my god I can't type declare with ultimate so yes I attacked with ultimate nightmare I declared my attack with ultimate nightmare but then he synchro summoned the field was changed when he summons the Spurs summon monster I still have to either attack with ultimate nightmare or change the attack in which I totally forgot that I could just attack with ultimate nightmare so I decided to go scrap so ultimate nightmare lost his attack for the turn so that's how it went that's the reason why I couldn't take him out like I said I'm guessing that's a GL2 in which case it's probably going to be a black rose if anything if it's not anything but black rose then he can't beat me so I think he's going to go for the Black Rose, hoping that, you know, I have nothing left, but it, the problem is that I have Limit Reverse Face down. So I will go ahead and chain, summon New Bell, Wall Get Wiped, Summon Terror, Arch Free Meter, I mean, Nefarious, Arch Free Nefarious, and this kill, Ultimate Nightmare, Summon, I mean, Kill Terror, Summon Ultimate Nightmare, and Summon Yourself. So I'm having a night tac tac game, so, yeah. It's either, it's going to come down to the card that he drew and the play that he does right now to the end of this duel. And right now, he doesn't have a tuner monster on the field that I see. So I might just go scrap. If he doesn't do anything and that's all he does is set. Oh, so it wasn't that. So he doesn't have a tuner monster. Oh, he's just going to take the damage on the chin. That's risky. That's risky, but he's definitely going to push for it. You know, as if I can't even make a fucking cowboy in this. So, I guess he's gonna, definitely going to go for um, uh, his boss monster, definitely. So, he's definitely going to go for Baxia. Baxia is going to spin back at least three. So it's going to be all my shit gone. Interesting. Interesting. I didn't think he was going to have the balls to take his shit and ram it into me, but... Interesting. That's scary. Wow, and he's just gonna leave it like that. All right. Back effect. Target. Oh my god, but then he could synchro summon again. Oh my god. I mean, how many, I wonder how many fives he runs. 
He can go for nine, and he can go for Miss Worm. Oh my god, if he does. Fuck. And it's during my main phase, too. Shit. He's probably gonna go for fucking Miss Worm. Shit. Ah, uh, uh, no, I want to keep our Treat Eater. I might go scrap target yourself. Because you can go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. You can go for Miss Worm. Or you can go for another 5 if he runs another 5. Or he can go into a 2, which wouldn't do anything. Or he can go into a, a 6, but there's no scary 6s. Ah. Uh. Oh my god. Alright. I'm gonna take the duel slow. Uh, I'm not gonna commit to anything. Alright. Going into battle phase. Response. Damn, it sucks. Looking top deck the shit out of himself. Ultimate Nightmare Attack. Is it another fucking deep prison? Uh huh. So, what are you synchroing for? Uh mm huh. Are you gonna go into nine? Like Miss Worm? One, two, three, four, five, six? That's not eight. That's seven. That's six. One, two, three. That was only. That was six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Your monster is eight. That was six. He's eight. This. <laughs> <sighs> All right, what to say? He's eight. Like, I'm like, he's like, oh, back to the deck. Good. Like, one, two, three, four, five, six. I mean, I know I can't count. I want to be a message. I know I can't count. But you're like, wait, he's seven? Like, no, he's eight. Like, damn. You know, like, if you want to go for Yazi, yes, you can go into Yazi. But Yazi wouldn't save you because I would just go out and attack Ultimate Nightmare anyway. The Ultimate Nightmare does not target, and you would take the damage anyway. So there you go. So I beat. Yang Zings. So you'll be seeing them on Thursdays. Anyway, I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode of Lime and Wine. So thanks for watching. Thanks for all the support. Like I said, I sure you do. That was the MVP of this duel because I'm trying to. I love that card. I, I wish I would see it more often because being able to just turn my freaking new bells into whatever form I want them to be in is just nice because, you know, sitting there with Terra on the field, what the fuck would that have done? Returning Ultimate Nightmare, getting aggressive on his ass, and it's like, oh, well, you know, I'm just going to float. That's fine, but you're still taking the damage. And that was the good stuff. So, aren't we neither? I, you know, I don't know. I don't know. I wish I would see you more often. Because when, when I do see you, you put in that work. So, I have nothing to say about that, sir. Anyway, I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode of I'm the So, thanks for watching. Thanks for all the support. And I will see you guys tomorrow with uh, U-Bucks Seas. All right. Thanks for watching.